Assalamu alaikum guys welcome to another character breakdown video yeah two two character videos in one uh, character breakdown videos in one week yeah because my I am not I don't have a really real good controller to play with right now and so going into ranked in online is gonna be uh, it's, it's kind of a uh, not a uh, award the experience but yeah before i start again again thanks to chill up music for uh, giving me the rights to their video and i mean giving me the permission to put the music in the video and let's get started with this so super saiyan goku the once king of dragon ball fighter z like every damn team you think of in evo or whatever tournament had him just because he had uh, just because of this kamehameha as his assist like every damn team had him and like he was the like like the most populated I mean the most play, uh, popular I mean popular character in Fighter Z like everybody had him and funny thing is uh, before season 3 I have never touched I have never played with him like in a match because I'm like I, I, there is Goku's anyway I don't need to like add to the population of Goku's I mean super percent Goku's that is so I, I never played him in a match uh, before but damn is it fun like uh, there is reason for people to blame but he did get a real bad change in this uh, in this season 3 so yeah, we'll we'll get to that when we get to that. So again, okay, starting with the specials, he has two specials in both air and gr ground. Both all of those are same. Quarter circle forward is the dragon flash phase. This uh, this move has three variations uh, depending on the one you use. And I think dragon flash it reaches uh, dragon flash is medium goes for ninety five percent. And then the ex version is actually a teleportation and and gives you a bouncing knockdown actually goku was the goku along with some other character was the first to receive, the, receive this bouncing knockdown like this this made i think i thought like this made him more privileged than he was in season two i'm like could you not give him more stuff like like this sliding knockdown or uh, sliding not on time on freaking the dragon flash is ridiculous like look at that i have time to do so much and that's just a light version I can grow cross him up like that. Like he can't do jack about it. He has to he has to hold that sliding knockdown like for so long. No matter what he does, like I'm 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 plus. I'm like mad plus after that sliding, sorry. Like you you don't have a say in this in the sliding knockdown that uh, SSJ Goku has, like you can do anything. Like look at that. I even mistimed his 2M now that is nerfed. Like, do you get the amount of time? And if you can, like, somehow medium dragon flash this, then you don't have any goddamn say of what I can do right now. Like, any, like, look at the time. Like, how much time do I have before before he wakes up? I, I have, like, me a million options there. And then the uh, EX version that teleports to where he is. And, and this is also a bouncing knockdown. And also like opens up a real good and some real alleyways to do his uh, combo combo extension because it'll it'll teleport anywhere. It teleports like to any uh, from anywhere in the screen whether you're on the high ground. I mean sorry, whether if you're like there or it doesn't matter. So it, it, he will track you to anywhere in the screen. If you're jumping, you're blo you're back dashing, it will catch you and it will teleport to that to exact position and like go there. So the startups on this move on the dragon flash fish are real slow because like uh, the the slowest one that the light the light variant is 24 flames the the uh, I mean uh, this, uh, the medium version uh, is 26 frames and and 24 frames again with the ex version but the but another thing the ex version can be 2 h the light and the medium cannot be 2 h but the EX version can be 2H but there is also another but that is the, when it starts like the, in, that, in that frame when Goku's in the instant transmission part of the EX variant is actually invincible so, so did you see Goku uh, as you could see that uh, Goku's uh, so again so as you could see it, it's a real good frame trap if you can use it correctly like uh, for example let's I mean, yeah, it's it's invincible in the first frame. That's why it's real hard. Like, it's you can do stuff like that, catch people off guard like that, and then go into a full combo. Nope, my turn. And then again, go for an easy knockdown. Also, yeah, if you if you have used uh, sliding smash properties, then they will not give you any, uh, you know, they will not give you any more knockdown 
So for example, I still have my uh, I still have my sli uh, sliding smash property. That's why I could. So now that I've used my sliding property, see, they, it will just give them a normal. Uh, so th that will give them a normal uh, uh, soft knockdown. So if you want to get sliding, always keep the sliding in, in check so that uh, you can always confirm and uh, always get a meterless knockdown after a vanish or any 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 kind of you know uh, sleeping. But then the other special is the Tatsu or the Flurry Kick. Uh, a lot of people call it Tatsu because they are from Street Fighters and stuff like the, 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 the Street Fighter Tatsum Tatsumaki no Senpo or something like that. Tatsumani, Tatsumaki Senpo or something? I don't, I'm not sure what that called. And that use famous 720 kick, 720 degree kick. So like uh, people call that Tatsu because fighting game players, you know. But I'm not a fighting game player that core because uh, this is probably my first fighting game that I'm playing competitively, uh, as in like at least trying to play competitively. So yeah, again, uh, for the Flurry Kick, he has like three variations. Uh, for the fly, uh, for the Flurry Kick, he has three variations: the light version, the medium, and the. So yeah, so uh, mo most probably, if you're not doing uh, any combos or stuff, you're most probably gonna use this, and it's like real safe. It's only minus, and it uh, and it's also a part of Goku uh, Super Saiyan Goku True Block String. So like this is actually a true blocking on his on his end. See, it's only 10 frames, and the yeah. medium variants are not. They like and it also has a like real bad you know recovery. So but you can if you you can catch it instantly if it like uh, hits too many times. But if it waves, then you cannot. But it actually is a like a good uh, you know <laughs> good traversal ability from full screen into the super dashing <laughs> you know do stuff like that and then the EX variation that also like reaches full screen and has like extra skin like it reaches full and some wow god damn so and you can also jump after that but uh, but uh, in oh no you, you can jump after both of them so yeah. The medium and the EX version, I I would say mostly would be used for combos and stuff. Like it gives you full corner carry into combos like this. So after using the EX version, you're like uh, you can easy super dash combo and go coast to coast like that. Uh, with the medium version, you cannot do that. But if you are like from mid screen. Then you uh, you can confirm with super dash corner guy like that is possible with the medium version of the Tatsumaki but so when you're full screen and like using key, spamming key blast then I would say the Tatsu would be a good idea to do like anti air people like that uh, you know if you read a super dash that is like I am just PMT super dash but they aim. But once they get starting, it's once the, once the Tatsu get starting, it's a, it, it, it will cause you catch their super dash. But it it ain't a reactable, uh, I'll say like reactable choice to like uh, uh, react to super dash with it. Uh, as you can see, like most of the time, I'm getting catch caught by it. But if you can read a super dash, then I'll say like Tatsu is a good way to keep you safe. Uh, the flurry kicks are, the, are a good way to keep it safe. The medium version, I don't, I don't think it has any use for like in helping you trying to zone. As you can see, the like, medium version gets caught by super dash every single time. But the light variant is actually pretty fast, so you could use that. You could always use that for super uh, super dash cancel like that. But I don't, I I think the ta uh, the flurry kick should have like anti air properties. Cause how, what does with Goku do? Except Kamehameha, that is her. Oh yeah, onto the third special, the Kamehameha, the Kame Senin, I mean the Kame House special, Kamehameha, so you know. Uh, there's nothing to really say for Kamehameha, it's a really good zoning tool and adds to like the fantastic neutral that Go Super Saiyan Goku ha still has to go to this day. And it's only 18 frames from close. So the Kamehameha is like 18 frame, uh, 18 frames from up close. Actually, wow, it's 19. Oh well, something like that. Uh, it's 18 frames. Please. It's 18 frames from up close. It can be angled up by holding down or holding up. Uh, holding up or down, like 
may, uh, makes the Kamehameha go up and when you're in air it go, makes you go down so this is a really good like mix up tool that uh, go Super Saiyan Goku players used to do like for example they would like take a cross up like they would fake a cross up like that and just uh, do same side Kamehameha or actually do stuff like that or do stuff like that you know same side same side uh, dragon flash face yeah and so that would conclude his special on to his block strings uh, his true boxing would be as follows Oh so uh, the entire part of that is a true block thing. Even that is a true block. But yeah, so like if you do that, that's a true block string. But uh, if you're in air and you do and you cancel out into the uh, the the light, so uh, a cancel like that makes you like minus 10 frames. So at that point, the any the opponent doesn't have anything to fear if you like already uh, dragon punch into like. I mean into our uh, into upper um, I mean down heavy into a cancel of fire kick is actually minus 10 so like that's really bad a bad situation for you but you can cancel into Kamehameha and you get spaced out real well but I that that isn't a part of a food block I believe uh, but uh, but this isn't but yeah that isn't the part of a food boss block string so like people can definitely reflect you and punish you for that you can definitely vanish out in time so you can vanish out but the single reflect will also 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 like uh, take out your vanish at the same time if they if they manage to reflect you so like uh, a cancel into tatsu is a good idea but if if you can read reflects but try to finish it like with a heavy into cancel like that and after that you're like much more safe on safe on block you can even backdash after that nobody can do anything to you let's test out if jab jabs can cancel a backdash on a flurry cancel hey you can you can escape ui goku's jab let's go after after a flurry, flurry cancel you can ex you can escape ui goku's jab so so what's what's more better than that <laughs> Most probably uh, Broly or Vegito might catch you but you have to be like precise with the backdash if you want to like still get out of pressure and not give them any chance of pressuring you. So yeah that uh, you can backdash off after a jab like you white Goku's come on bro that's such a plus. <laughs> but like before people used to uh, used to spam his like 2M because it, it was so fast and like you had like minimal recovery you can you could actually still spam me like look at that but people now know that like he's uh, his 2M is now 14 frames so like people can actually people now actually has uh, actually can dare to like uh, uh, press a button be between his uh, 2Ms like a 2M stagger but like base Goku base Goku's one is much more faster so like people used to do that like with UI Goku people used to do this like legit uh, UI Goku, I'm sorry. People uh, uh, before, with SNG Goku, people used to like just do this, like staggering a two. I'm like, that's so freaking BS. Like when I used to first see that, so like mainly people would just do like stuff like this, and then do stuff like that. But uh, with the nerve that UI Goku got into into his two M, UI Goku's two M now reaches a lo are, are long long distance. Like I think uh, approximately 25 percent, uh, 20 percent of the screen. Yeah, see, approximately 25 percent of the screen. So like you can you can catch people off guard like if you like manage to space them out like a, like uh, for example go with a block thing like that and also his standing medium is like uh, it is an advancing normal so like you can definitely like uh, catch people off guard like with stagger like let's see let's say like uh, his tool his also reaches pretty good but it's not a low hitting tool so that so the uh, problem is that you cannot like really open people open people up with like normal normals of his is you have to like innovate to like actually open people up like a jab into a cross up oh God. like jab into medium into like doing doing and uh, getting into an over before a down medium or go go for a cross up like that but the problem is they like his 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 one low and his like uh his special uh, his special cancel into a, a his special uh, overhead cancel is bo are both slow like his uh, his one low is 14 frames and the and the uh, dragon flash the fastest dragon flash is 24 frames so like people can easily react to it in on in offline situations in off in online you it's also slightly reactable but uh, there's a chance that people might get caught 
But you can still, if it, if online, you can still pull up this this chat of like do it, uh, of like pulling off like stuff like that. You can still do that. But he's uh, but uh, yeah, that two M nerf is kind of uh, a problem. But I feel like uh, uh, since Bluku has like uh, so many lows, like even in a uh, even in his auto combo, he has a low. So I feel like Bluku's uh, Bluku's two uh, L should be given to. Uh, you know, Super Saiyan Goku, and uh, they they should get a 2L uh, switch on like these both characters because Bluko has enough enough of a lows to like open people up when he's up close. Bluko breakdown will be later. I'll do I'll do one on later on him. So I feel like they could like do that. Uh, but like base Goku, for example, has common grab. You can always always buffer that and do stuff like this. So I feel like uh, you should uh, uh, Super Saiyan Goku should get another, uh, you know, uh, opening, uh, open uh, to get another like uh, something to help his help with his mix because as far as 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 in the state he is now there is no mix like like Goku Black he he lacks in the mix department but. But, but like Goku Black, he also like has incredible neutral. Uh, so uh, 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 so for the for another round, uh, another blo full boxing round that uh, Super Saiyan Goku has is that like with key blast, ending the ending it with a key blast, so like that. So all of that is a full boxing, and as you could see, like it, uh, they, it like if they stand block it, then they'll they'll be like really good space out because the the key blast pushes them away. Even for crouch block, this is this will be the same. So like let's move on to the neutral. So yeah, Goku has a uh, Super Saiyan Goku has a total of six key blasts on the ground. All of them are real fast. Like, see, all of them like uh, up close 13 frames, and like he has like insane key blast option. And then he also has the like uh, up key blast option, like which has real good hit stand to go for combos. And then and then a key blast that that reaches the enemy position full screen from like a you know uh, from from a super jump uh, height. But you cannot, uh, you, you won't be able to hit them from a normal jump. Like uh, you have to double jump to hit them, or something like that. But but then, uh, sorry. But then you can do stuff like that, uh, double jump into two key blasts. But easily you can hit stuff like that. And like he has like, and his zoning is like still fantastic as of the game. He, you can still zone you, out zone you, kame, with kamehamehas and key blasts. Like his zoning isn't any any bad as it was. Like uh uh you know, an opponent like who's too antsy, who doesn't respect your zoning, you can definitely catch them off guard. Like he still has like real good zoning on his uh, on his back pocket. Like uh, the option of having a kamehameha in in air is just pretty good. Like he's pretty good, and his key blast options are real good. Like let's say, like you you can even stagger with the key blast. So, so that that's like so good. Like yeah, he's uh, you can do stuff like that. So yeah. His key blast options are pretty good, and then, and then for combos he has like stuff like that. And let's say like op your opponent is like jumpy, like from like stuff like that, then you can easily cancel into. So you can always like uh, catch people like that who are trying to, you know, jump up in every situation. See, like I can just, I can, I could just can and also come here. So yeah, you can uh, like he has like real good air options too. So, as you could see, it has a real good angle. So, like, you cannot uh, if from a single jump you cannot, but uh, you if the super jump, then you can almost catch them from like 50% of the screen with a, I mean, jail them 50% uh, of the screen. Then he has also has a uh, also has a beam that jails into a vanish. So, like, he has really good neutral tools still yet. But if you want to, then you can. Uh, now moving on to his assist. The, uh, the super single go the famous beam assist. Like this is the only reason I think people used to like play him in every freaking every every team like having like every team. and it's only it's almost because of this because he has a like real fast beam that that came out like at 34 frames and like give you gave his chance and so it helped you in neutral like in neutral it was such a such a helper and that's why every people have it but now half the cast has a beam as so 
his value kind of drop. Now this BS is the BS is the uh, light flurry kick. Like it is a multi hitting and so it's a block block stun assist. So like it's 40 frames and it's only 25 frames. So like it's real good. Like that's also one of the better assists. For but it also like uh, it it, uh, it doesn't start from your person. It starts a lead little bit in front of you. So like it, it'll travel like to like half the half the screen. So like as you can see the distance. So like it, it don't count on it to like uh, help on your neutral. But it can maybe like honestly, Flare Kick just should get an anti air. Flare Kick should get anti air properly. Like come on. They, it does it should like but you can do stuff like that I guess uh, yeah but no it, 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 it isn't going to like it isn't going to help you with your neutral but it but it, but it can definitely help with your block strings because it's with, because it's 40 flames of block stun after that like they ha they have to like hold that like you can do you can go go back and forth over their head once if uh, like if you can manage if you have like good uh, handling of your character so yeah that is uh, BS, uh, BS assist the C assist is the uh, is, is actually what do you call the auto combo auto combo into dragon flash fist uh, and you know they hold it's also a block stun assist so like it's a multi hitting block stun assist uh, again with 50 frames so uh, but but again uh, he already has a full screen beam that you can use to use so uh, I shouldn't need to say much more about how CSS works. So you already at this point know like how the CSS works. It's 45 frames and you know. So yeah, uh, you know the CSS drills and like if you want to use them, then use them. So that's how you CSS work, I guess. Wow, that's some huge normal. And yeah. Yeah, and that is CSS. So that's what I have done. So yeah. So let's get the uh, the dethroned king into the center stage, and yeah, hopefully you, hopefully you enjoyed the character breakdown of. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed and and learned something from the character breakdown of the dethroned king of Dragon Ball Fighter Z, Super Saiyan Goku. And yeah, now I'll be moving on to the combo section. If you did enjoy, please leave us a like and consider subscribing. It will help me out a lot. And thank you so much for your time. And I'll see you in the next one. I love this.